there, Albert is Dumbledore with an episode of Surfside Creeps. Today we're going to be looking at a shitty baller house. And I only say shitty because, well, it's the Surfside. <laughs> okay, let's go inside. So, as you can see, we have now entered this baller's house. We don't know which baller it is, but it seems as though they're all leaving the sack anyway, so it doesn't fucking matter. But as we see, they have some kind of artwork on the walls. This person seems to think he has a sense of artistical processly thought theory. Maybe if he had like one piece or Naruto or something cool like anime, that would be better because that's what the young kids are into today. And as we come, we have some Aztecian stuff as a baller. So this is strange as well. And as we come over here, we have a some strange form of shrine of like purple shit. Again, with this failed art piece and this banana it's fake i don't like it all right you move into the next room well it's almost like i'm a child again back in my day we would play games like this and pac-man so this i actually approve is kind of neat oh this is actual artwork with cool cars and motorcycles i do uh, i do approve of this they have a little step to get inside of the kitchen. Let's try this. I don't want to fall. I am quite old. Oh, I, I did it. I, I, I didn't fall. Ah, fuck! So, it does seem as though the floor up here is hardwood. It's quite nice. Uh, I said hardwood. <laughs> but it's quite slippery, so you have to be quite careful as you uh, come upon this kitchen. Um, it seems as to be, uh more of a modern uh, kitchen. It, it, it is up to date. I do like the, the double sink. I, I think the double sink is a plus. Oh, and they do have an espresso machine. That's no, not bad. Who the hell is the house, bro? What the hell? Oh. <laughs> don't mind. Don't mind us. We're just, we're just going through your shitty, uh, somewhat nice house. Don't mind us. Uh, and over here, they seem to have, have the laundry room mixed in with the... the now, I have found something quite horrible. These people are cleaning dirty money in these washers. What do they think? They're a casino or something? And they even have dirty drug briefcase here. I think there's coke in there. I don't... I'm not really sure if it was actually coke or nothing. <coughs> but... <coughs> One of the rooms we have found seems to be some kind of source of mechanically mechanical things he does oh my god there seems to be gun parts and blueprints on this bench over here good heavens someone call the police we need a one year long unnecessary charge and then no investigation what's oh no i'm just joking i don't know what the fuck he's doing in here please. um yo and the living get room. The out of here man it's gonna get blasted bro Hey, please, please relax. We're just doing our TV show. We want no problems. You probably can't aim anyway. You are I a baller. I'll start clapping. Hey, relax. I saw you on the C tier list. You're not that dangerous. Please relax. We can make our way into the living room and see how this is. The living room seems as well to be modern with a nice large LCD TV. Or is, is that how you say it? A LCD, LED, LED TV? It's not bad. It's not bad. The table seems to be kind of like cheap Walmart shit. They could have done better. Uh, more shitty artwork. Uh, I don't know why they think this is art. It's just garbage they threw on a wall. Quite interesting. So let's let's uh, let's take it from the the living room, which wasn't like the worst, but it wasn't the best, and and um, bring it into the bedroom. Hopefully that ball is not in there, beaten off, waiting for me. What a coward! He's scared of my magical prowess. No, the final room, the test of all tests. And I am here on his bed, giving it a 1 out of 10. It feels like the springs are flying through my bunghole as we speak. It is a bed, but it's not the best bed. He does seem to have a uh, stand over there, but no chair. And he seems to have left 
the only Vatos premium subscription on his screen. Oh, he's dirty. A baller trying to get with a Vago. Dirty. <laughs> anyway, let's move over into the bathroom. Now, it does seem very plain. It, it just doesn't make sense because he has a modern kitchen and the living room. It just, it's quite confusing. So, before I give my rating, I do want to check out the man's yard because you can find out a lot about a person and how they take care of their yard. Alrighty. Oh, fuck! I stepped in shit! God damn it! It's disgusting! Hello there. We've come to an end to Southside Creeps. And we will finish this house off with looking at this man's yard. And I dare say so myself. It is very bland and plain and not even a grill in sight. And once more, to explain what we just went through in this house, it's clearly right here on the floor. Absolute shit! I did not enjoy this house whatsoever, but I will. I will say that there were some things that were nice about this, which will then put me at a 4 out of 10. Albertus Dumbledore signing out. Till next week, we might even visit the Vagos. Toodaloo!